we want to accept everything. Y'all notice what I tell you. Y'all ain't know the level of debauchery is at an all-time high. Y'all say, oh, wait, wait, wait. Darius, we talking about one of your favorite things. We talking about twerking. <laughs> Ever since that whole Too Loud challenge, I've been seeing posts like this. So this post says, you gotta be a strong-ass ninja to have a twerking-ass girlfriend. I've also seen that post where that guy was like, you can't be my girl shaking ass on social media. Men that believe this or make posts like that are very insecure. And you can't convince me otherwise. Because the main reason why they don't want... Basically, like, you can't have no level of, like, relationship privacy, in a sense. Like, like should social media be seeing my girl like that? Like, men are insecure if they get if they have a problem with their girl twerking on the internet but he's supposed to want to marry you his parents are supposed to see this but everybody's seeing your body your butt your, your backside however you want to put it your anatomy fellas this just in if you have boundaries and morals for yourself you're insecure now wait but it gets better I guarantee you, if you hold the phone while she's doing twerking videos, she'll respect you and you'll be a lot more secure and you'll probably be the leader of that relationship. <laughs> See how dumb that sounds? No man could give me advice if his woman is on social media showing her bare naked behind or shaking things. You can't talk to me about women. You can only talk to me about how much of a cook that you are. Now, if you believe in what she's saying, cool. That's up to you. And if you can be controlled by the viscous innards, more power to you. But we all know where this leads. <laughs> we all know where this leads, man. <laughs> That's crazy. This this the card they gonna pull. Oh no, you just worry about other men. See, him. this girl made this video with a fucking bonnet on her head. We can see, like, I'm not even gonna go too far in. We can just see what y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. But let, let's hear what Buddy got to say. Yeah. They hold on to it for dear life. Mm -hmm. But when she when she feels as though she, you're not the best deal she can get, what she's really trying to do is she's trying to test the waters, mm -hmm. see if she can get another high value man. And then if it doesn't work out with him, she's going to come back to your okay, sim. You, you got to set boundaries for yourself. I, I seen a shorty post. Oh, why don't why men don't date strippers? Why men are so insecure about dating strippers? And I'm like, I, I, I know niggas who date strippers like. I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, I, 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 I see what you're saying. You're saying, why do men who choose not to date strippers choose not to date strippers? You're not saying, why do, you're not saying men choose not to date strippers. No, you're saying that men you like or choose, find out you're a stripper or beat you at the club and won't date you. That's what you're finding out. That's your experience. your experience but it's not all men don't date strippers and it's not it's not because you're having this experience that now all men are insecure if if someone expressed their something they don't like or don't want especially when it comes to men and women on both sides everybody get all up in arms like everybody it ain't you know how many women will not be on the internet twerking don't care about that would never want to do that there's a there's people for that. Do y'all know everyone's not going to be a police officer? No, we're we're all not signed up for that. Don't go out and try to be a cop in public, please. Please don't try to be a fireman. Please don't try to be. Please don't even try to bag my groceries. Those people learn how to do that shit too. Coal with the coal, chemicals with chemicals. I'm dead ass serious. Don't try to do shit you don't even know how to do. You know what I'm saying? So. That, that's all I'm saying. There's somebody out there for that. So just like everybody don't make prom or, or prom, what they call it? What they call it? Prom because we can't say it on on, on YouTube. <laughs> well, people do actions in the movies. <laughs> when you pull up at a gas station in certain cities, it's somebody there that'll pump your gas. Do you know I've never experienced that before? Because I live in, in, in the city in Florida. I never experienced somebody pumping my gas. But that's what they do. So, when you so concerned about, oh, whether this person twerking or not, it's like, no, shorty. There's guys out there that like women like that. But you can't expect 
certain type of dudes to like that. It got nothing to do with nobody being insecure. It got to do with their preference and their level of understanding of how they want to do things. That's a very nice way of putting it. What it really got to do with is a nigga making a level of discernment. And if anybody can have you shot, if anybody can see it, if I can come pay you to see it right now, why would I want to make you my girlfriend? Some dudes think that way. Do every dude think that way? No. Like I said, there's somebody out there for you. Don't say men don't date strippers, because yes, they do. I know plenty of niggas that date strippers, baby, please. Like, come to my city, shit. You'll find a nigga out here, because they damn sure date strippers out here. I don't, I don't know what you got going on. I live in the strip capital of the world. And like I said, it's just, it's based on the type of decision somebody want to make for themselves. People may consider certain things more of a headache or more of an issue than they may like to put up with. So... Y'all want to keep that in mind for y'all be generalizing people all the damn time. Man, because somebody don't want to participate in the action. You want to participate in the way you want to participate. And then what? He a hypocrite because he come throw a hundred, two hundred, a thousand, ten thousand. He a hypocrite because he love the strip club because he eat there because he pop bottles and he there every week, but he won't date nobody. Like, you can enjoy the environment, the ambiance and all the festivities and still understand what you willing to, you know, keep as, keep as, a, you know what I'm saying? That's something you about to take home. You can still make that decision. It don't make you a bad person. Y'all know what I say. Next video.